it's one of the important question in the interview point of view. When we say jobs are mandatory for human capital management implementation and positions are optional, how can you suggest to your client? How can you suggest to your client saying that positions are required for your business or just jobs are required for your business? How can you suggest? Very simple. If the clients are looking for detailed approvals, if the clients are looking for detailed approvals, then positions are required. If the client wants to maintain the budget, financial budget considerations, then positions are required. If the client says that I wanted to have the head control, then positions are required. These three are required for the client means definitely we have to implement the positions. If client says that I don't want all these three, then jobs are sufficient. We don't need positions. That's the answer we are supposed to give. So if they ask us like, can you tell me in which uh, scenario or for which client you would like to go for suggest the positions, you can say that jobs are mandatory for HCM implementation, but positions are required only when the organization wants to have the detailed approvals, when the organizations wanted to implement the budget, when the organizations wanted to have some control on the headcount, means number of employees you would like to recruit for a particular position, you wanted to have control. If you need all these features, then we required the positions. Otherwise, jobs are sufficient. That's the answer we are supposed to keep. The next question is related to the jobs and positions. When we are working with the jobs, we will assign jobs to reference data set. We will assign jobs to reference data set, reference data set to business unit. But positions directly assigned to the business unit. Positions directly assigned to the business unit. What, what is the reason behind that? It's very simple. Most of the jobs are common. That's why we will assign these jobs to the business unit through the reference data set. The advantage is you don't need to create multiple types. The job name you need to create multiple times. The same job can be assigned to multiple BUs automatically. That's the advantage. But positions are specific to the business unit. If client says that in this BU, I'm selling the goods to my customer. It means indirectly that is a sales office. When there is a sales office, definitely there will be an employees who are related to the sales department, who are related to the sales positions. Right. So positions are based on the business unit, means specific business unit. That's why positions we will assign directly to the BUs but jobs will be assigned through reference data set to the B. That's the difference uh, why we are using the reference data set for job, why we are not using the reference data set for position. These two are very important interview point of view, especially when we are working in the implementation also, the decision making as a functional consultant, or we are supposed to suggest to our client also like this. This is how we are supposed to specify. Okay, so that's uh, one of the important questions uh, from the jobs perspective as well as the positions. We will be interacting with the client, gather the total number of jobs and total number of positions and we'll try to configure it. Without jobs, we cannot implement the position. If you want to create a position, you must have a jobs. You must have the jobs. Another important question in the positions point of view is, if I want to create a position, what are the objects are required? 
if you want to create a position, job is mandatory. Business unit is mandatory. Department also is mandatory. Without job, without department, without business unit, you cannot create a position. Not possible. These three objects are mandatory. These three objects are mandate. That's how we are supposed to configure it. Okay. So this is uh, these are three important questions we can expect in the interviews related to the jobs and positions when we are uh, attending for global HR point. Thank you.